to another episode of the Overpowered Not Top 5 Plays of the Week, the countdown that Activision doesn't want you to see. Wouldn't be a countdown without a bullshit melee clip, so here at number 5 is BR, Z Hero here, getting fisted from across the room! Check out the game winning kill cam, these two aren't even close to one another! That's fucking ridiculous right there! Checking in at the number 4 spot is Mike, Mr. 748 playing a little gun game, or is he? He can't spawn back in after a death! Are you fucking kidding me, Sledgehammer? How do you allow this shit to happen in your game? That's completely unacceptable. Speaking of which, number three is Samuel for life right here, hanging out behind the bar when he gets RPG through the goddamn wall. Go home, Black Ops 2, you're drunk. Look at this shit, Von der Haar. And at the number two spot is some epic bad luck from Andrew Aldis right here, who goes and gives that guy a proctology exam, but then he explodes in the middle of the air. Look at the kill cam, it's the guy that he just fisted. Check this shit out, as he fists him, he gets stuck by that dude Semtex. That's a one in a million death here. But something that's not one in a million death, pure sped tarted at the number one spot with this amazing spawn logic here on comeback uplink. Look at this shit, Sledgehammer. These people are staring right at the same spawn point. Then Elizio Alcala right here gets stuck in the same bullshit. How the fuck is this acceptable? How is this a safe spawn? I seriously hope at the MLG Call of Duty Championships that somebody exposes Sledgehammer for this epically broken bullshit right here. This is fucking unbelievable. In a competitive game mode, you have a unbelievable spawn fuck like this. You guys ought to be a Ashamed of yourselves. Again, three year development cycle. What the fuck have you been doing the whole time? Some people have told me that this only happens in 6v6 uplink, but I secretly hope at the esports event that these guys become a laughing stock if this is exposed. Anyways, if you got any bullshit clips, be sure to send them in. Overpoweredplays at gmail.com, subject line not top five, and be sure to include your channel.